folks, Alan Wassum here, and I'm going to walk you through what FTP is real quick um, and how you use it and how you uh, get it linked into your website. FTP, the term, stands for File Transfer Protocol, okay? And you use FTP to upload um, files to your server. And I just wanted to show you one FTP transfer solution, and it is uh, FileZilla. You can go to FileZilla. Uh, dash project dot org um, and what FileZilla allows you to do is it it puts the FTP on your your main uh, desktop here I don't have it set up but it would show up somewhere around right in here uh, and you can just click on it that way you don't have to log into your hosting account and use their free uh, FTP solution but that's what I'm going to show you because I know FileZilla is just a little bit more advanced but anyway here I am in my host monster control panel which is you know after you set up an account after you buy a domain with host monster or whoever you buy it from you'll get a back office or a control panel now for host monster what you want to do is you come down here to this little class called files okay and here you're gonna wanna click on unlimited FTP alright and I know a lot of you are like what the hell is FTP what can I use it for if you need a file uploaded to your website or your server, this is the way you do it. And uh, an example of when you'll need this, just up front, is uh, Google. Is when you want to register your website with Google or, or webmaster account. Um, let me see this. Yes, allow. Um, you know, what, let me walk you through that right now, actually, too. Is uh, to register. A website with Google and my computer is taken forever ah, come on I'll just go over here type in Google webmaster tools okay click on that and see I've got my websites already registered create with Alan my blog okay now what you'll want to do to when you first start out and your site is not registered with Google Webmaster Tools you want to click add a site and then I'll just since I already have it on there I'll do that okay and verification method you could either do meta tag or upload an HTML file now when you upload an HTML file this is what you're going to be using FileZilla or your uh, unlimited FTP transfer in your hosting back office. Okay, so you will click download this HTML verification file. I have already downloaded one. I put it right here. I know I'm completely disorganized, but um, there it is, right there on my desktop. Okay, so I've got it downloaded. Now, what I need to do is get it to my website. How can I get that HTML file from my desktop onto my website? you do that by using your FTP transfer. So you click on your unlimited FTP and I'm gonna go through all of this again of course. Okay this right here on the left is your computer. This is everything that's on your computer, all files, everything you you know you got. Um, and it just shows you everything that's on your hard drive. Okay so what you want to do is you want to go down and come to users double click, double click on whoever you are and then you'll come down and right here wherever you save that file is where you'll want to click and then you'll search for the HTML file they gave you and you see mine came up right here I've got two of them because I've done two but there it is Google then a bunch of numbers and then you'll want to click this button I'm not gonna do it because I have already done it and I don't want two of the same file on there all it does will slow down your servers and get you all backed up but then you'll click this right here and it'll go over and it'll be uh, registered in here but you want it under public HTML you don't want to do it just right away you want it under public HTML um, where everyone uh, will be able to access it where Google will be able to get a hold of it um, see there's mine right there under public HTML and that's that's basically what FTP is used for that's how you register um, a website with Google
so there you go. I hope you got a lot out of this. I hope it cleared a little bit uh, of your confusion up. Now, FileZilla, what is FileZilla? FileZilla is just your, uh, where did that go? Is this. FileZilla is FTP right here. But what it does, it allows you to just put it on your desktop up here somewhere. Uh, so that way you don't have to log in to your host monster account or your server. So it, it's, it's the same exact thing. It's just a shortcut. And uh, what makes it a little different is, and a little bit more advanced, is that you have to fill in your server account, this and that, your password. It's really easy. They have overviews on how to do it. Um, but that's all FileZilla is. That's how you register your website with Google. Um, and so there you go. I hope you understand that now. It was kind of confusing for me at first, and every now and then I still get a little confused on uploading files, but you're uh, taking a step in the right direction. So I hope you guys got a lot out of it, and I will be talking to you guys later. Take care.